Um, we're going to start with you, Mr. Le Greco. You yes. called this fight out for a long, long time. Um, we know you're a joker character, but at the end of the day, we know you love to win, you love to fight, and you're here to win as well. Um, a big fight for you, and one you're very confident in. Well, I'll start off like this. Who the fuck is Phil Le Greco? That's what I. A lot of people all, have been asking. All Twitter trolls that I read, I read, I read them all. Who the fuck is Phil Le Greco? I'll get to that in a minute. I will get to that in a minute, but I would like to start off by thanking God for giving me the opportunity to be here. Uh, without him, nothing's possible. I want to thank Al Heyman, Sam Watson, man, God bless those two. They've done so much for me. I want to thank you for giving me the opportunity to be here and give me time to get ready. Three months. No promoter does that. Thank you, for real. And you saw the size of you, that's why. Uh, uh, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. Calm down, we'll get to you in a minute. Now, it was about time you pulled up your skirt. It was about time. It was about time you pulled up your skirt. It was about time you pulled up your skirt and you entered to your tea party. Are you done now? How's your hand? Show me your hand. Can you go like this? Show me your hand. Can you go like this? I'm going to try your face. I'm going to try your face. I'm gonna, gonna you, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you on. Uh, what are you gonna show? What are you gonna I'm show? Gonna show my, what I have, what I have Listen, this guy over here, here he's nothing but a salesman. Okay. He's selling you guys all the ideas. Yeah, they do, but it's, all you guys do is eat it up. Winning world title, the salesman. You're a salesman, bro. You're a salesman. You know you've been out right? right. for two years, right? Now you sign with all, with Eddie Hearn, and you're selling the people that there's hope. You want to fight Kill Bro. You're looking for every way out to fight Kill Bro. If you want to fight Kill Brook, you fight at 54. Because Kill Brook is 154. Now, did I say not I wasn't coming down to 47? Did I say I was going to fight 47 or you came up to me to fight me at 150? I never said I was going to be a 547. You cried like a bitch, that's why. So 147 is the way. You cried like a bitch. I cried like a bitch. No, no, because I was eating. I was eating. I was eating. I was, I was enjoying my show, Culinary Fight. I was eating some rich food. I was minding my business. I can tell, love. Maybe you can see that. Hey! Double chin, no chin. Double chin, no chin right here. All right, no, double chin. <laughs> listen, we will see on the 21st. We're gonna listen. You, you know, I even he does that. He does that sell fight. This is what I love about this guy. Look, this guy's my first. It's my salesman. I'm salesman. Yeah, look, you want to come in at 147? He wants to fight at 147. Let's take a look at the list. Danny, Danny Garcia, work your ass. Sean Porter, Steve Mosey, Earl Spence, let's not even go there. Keith Thurman, let's not even talk about it. If you really want to have a chance and make some money, you say, you know what, I want to fight Kel Brook at 54. That's your only chance. Now, no, no, we're looking for every way out. We're looking for every way out. Not to fight Kel Brook. Okay, so you're calling yourself a bum. You're calling yourself a bum. You're calling yourself a bum. So you're calling yourself a bum, basically. You mentioned all that name, but you didn't mention your own name. You're my 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 name. Yo, you're my tuna. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm your, your, okay, we'll see. No. I'm you're his tuna. tuna. I'm his tuna. Okay, nobody, that's fine. Knows, nobody knows about my career, all the ups and downs that I've had, all the years of inactivity. Oh, yeah, man. so you're my tuna. I need a tuna fight. But say, you know what? I would like to fight you. You're shit. That's why. That's why. I'm not messing with you. Where's my fucking tuna, bro? You come to, you come to Liverpool. We can have a brilliant fight in Liverpool. Okay, listen, you know, you listen, can listen, talk. Listen, well, you, listen, yo, yo, I hope your fist you're talking. I hope your fist you're the same talking. One at a time. One at a time. You go. Oh, no. Big moment, man. I've got a question for you. I've got a question for you. Can I finish my you, You've stepped up to world level before. Errol Spence, we know you had very, very little time. How long? 48 hours, 60 yeah. pounds. You yeah. fucking try that. You do that. You got no boss to do that. You got no boss to do that. Me or Emmett? I got both. Come on, man. That's why I give you three months. I've got big balls. Trust me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Phil, the question was is that you've stepped up to world level before. And, and fell short. I got banged today. Yeah. <laughs> what difference yeah. this time around and what happens in the fight with you and Is it going to banged again? Well, obviously, obviously, no, no, no. obviously, there must be something going on within my mind to be confident. You don't just come all over here in the UK and you start talking shit. And it's a pitch, and, just, Oh, please. And, and by the way, and by the way, this fool over here thinks I'm this is the biggest payday. Not even close. I didn't say that. Not even close. Oh, you're coming to the picture. Not even you cheap fucks. Not even yeah. close. <laughs> not even close. Listen, that, that, I'm going to leave to Eddie Hearn because Eddie, what's, it, what's happened there, Eddie? Not even fucking close. I thought he was a lot of money. Honestly, honestly, it's honestly the fact that I My believe in myself. Here. I believe in myself. For me to come over here, you take all the heat. And there's one thing I want to say. I fight everywhere around the world. 
But you haven't gotten it all unless you come to UK. Because UK fans, you guys come out and support. Look at this room, it's full. In the States, we don't see that. For real. I'm being honest. I mean, you guys, in the States, people are lazy. In North America, we just, we'll buy the pay-per-view. We'll support the fighter. But over you guys come out and fill the arenas. That's the now best let's, thing let's talk said. about your losses. That's the two losses, isn't it? I have losses, four. Not the world champion. I got beat by people. Is, you have to listen. I'm talking. Please listen. Just listen. Just listen to what I'm about to say. After the Canelo loss, you went on a losing streak. Family. Wife. Then... Oh. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, guys, guys. This is not Pakistan versus India. It's not a cricket match. Please. Please. And then... You go out and you tweet to the heavyweight champion of the world. What is wrong with you, mate? What is wrong? You go out and you tweet to the heavyweight champion of the world that he can have your laughter. Thank you. 